Good morning, ladies and gentlemen. Now, my presentation is uh, Why Performance Matters. That's a very strange title, and uh, I will try to make this work. Should I point you? No. Point your hidden laser yeah, what is it? Oh, I'm done. That's a Star Wars uh, sword, okay? Now, first water evolution. Wow, what does it mean? Okay, let's go through the agenda. Uh, who is E4? And I am with E4 Computer Engineering. What is innovation in E4? Why we call this presentation fast forward and uh, where from now? Final, feel free to drop by in our booth when uh, we open. We are, we, we are happy to talk with you guys. Now, the company. Uh, we are a, a small, relatively small system integrator in Italy, founded in 2002. Uh, we pride ourselves uh, to be the best system integrator all over the world and uh, we bring new products to fruition. Uh, new products is the key, is the link, uh, is the life of our company. i let you read. We are basically focusing on anything which may innovate in our uh, customer base. Our core values are, uh, you see over there, I can I let you read, but you know, we are ethical. We pride ourselves to be an ethical company, and uh, some uh, some key figures. We were founded in 2002. We have more than 50 employees, uh, and so on. We installed uh, uh, thousands of units at CERN, and uh, as you can see, 70 percent. Uh, of our staff is uh, devoted to R&D. It's possibly the largest uh, share all over the world. But, but why it is? Because we want to have our innovative products, we want to innovate, we want to bring innovation to our customers. And uh, here are some very quick milestones. In 2005, we started the first uh, InfiniBand cluster, then uh, moving on, uh, we have been on top of any innovation wave. And uh, last but not least, uh, we have installed uh, a first uh, open power server in 2016. And uh, uh, in 2017, we will uh, have a, a, a possibly a large cluster. As you can see there, we have been on the, at the top of any uh, technology uh, wave for innovation. And uh, what it means to us? Basically, is uh, trying to understand what is the uh, most important uh, innovation that uh, the technology is providing, uh, is uh, either finding new applications for existing technology or the, or the other way around, and then test, validate, and deploy, so bring to market what the innovation is, uh, and we listen to our customers. So we are not just developing in a sort of uh, black box. We want to listen to our customer, what they are looking for, what they would like to have, and, and whatever. So this uh, two degree of freedom, innovation, and listening to customer is our uh, DNA. And uh, we think that uh, x86 uh, is the current uh, technology. We deliver, we sell a product based on x86. Uh, Power is technology as of now, but uh, open power in now means innovation. Open power is open, and this is a key value, so the customers are not locked uh, to a specific uh, vendor, as it happens right now, but uh, it can source its uh, solution from different vendors. Uh, open, it's innovative, but production-oriented. There are a lot of uh, innovative things which just doesn't work. Uh, we don't want to be there. We want to deliver work, working innovation. And uh, I don't think our US friends understand this. It is uh, a agent provocateur in, in a stagnant world. As of now, innovation has been basically zero in the last uh, 10 years. Uh, Everybody is going to SC or ISC. Uh, you see the same, uh, the same stuff all over the world, uh, all over the show floor. The same structure, the same nodes, the same uh, uh, InfiniBand cluster or whatever. So in, with this uh, new uh, platform, uh, this is bringing innovation to a, a, a very stagnant world. And uh, 
if for, for business reason is and will remain uh, uh, hardware agnostic, we will continue to have our current product line, we will stay in the same technology curve as the provider of uh, our systems, but at the same time we are building confidence that uh, open power is the way to go for the future and uh, for, for good, for good reasons. Uh, I mean, uh, the first one is the fact that uh, all the good technical features that our customers are looking for are there. Open Power is providing uh, what the, the customer in the market are looking for natively. Is running on internet? Sorry? Yeah, <laughs> You have a point, we have to talk, come to our booth. <laughs> uh, that's a sort of message to our friend with IBM. <laughs> okay, because uh, uh, it needs, it brings innovations uh, in what is now a very uh, boring world. Uh, it, uh, it is uh, Look at the, well, the, the, the market is looking for a new solution, uh, and we'll see a bit uh, later. And uh, last but not least, it's very cool. I mean, everybody's talking about that. Uh, everybody is uh, trying to have something new in, uh, in his computer center or in, uh, in his uh, uh, place. Uh, now, we have to, to, to agree on a way forward. So we have the community right now, which is uh, engaged in this new exciting project. Uh, uh, we have uh, uh, products already working, already installed, and feel free to drop in our booth to see them. And uh, we are at the very beginning of a major technological transition. So, the consumption, how the compute, how the power is used, is on, uh, on the edge of a transition. And you can see there are a couple of words, you know, there are buzzwords where everybody can agree, but we are experienced in this moment, we are really at, at the beginning of the transition of technology, and we have to stay on top of it. We have to stop, it. we have to stop thinking the old way, and we have to start thinking a new way. And, and this, moment, these days, are the right time to jump in these new technologies in, and to go full steam ahead in front of us with this new product. What's missing, what we feel as a system integrator is missing, uh, is basically the usual suspect uh, third-party ISVs codes. We, we, we feel that uh, the, the architecture needs, so as soon as we can, uh, to go full steam into, into manufacturing, uh, planning, uh, engineering, uh, automotive, with this application, without third party application, and you can name whatever you want, uh, you, you won't uh, make a major strike in, in this market. So we need this, we need to have uh, these applications uh, ported and available. Now, a bit of uh, you know, self-advertising, we have a booth, we, we love to talk with our customers, feel free to uh, drop by, we are uh, keen to listen to what you say, we are keen to talk with partners, we, we want to create our own ecosystem on top of open power, so we will listen to you and uh, write notes and, uh, and all the rest. The contacts are here. Uh, you can write to me, I am the guy with a very strange name, this one, or our CTO, which is somewhere in this uh, city. And uh, if you have any questions. Uh. Yeah, thank you. Ah, you're welcome. Thanks. Well, close to.